What's going on, Washington football team fans? It's your boy back with another video. And as you see, Dan Snyder plans on buying the other 40% of the Washington football team, which will make him the only owner. He's buying all the shares from all the other minority owners. I think it's three other ones. And that's going to make Dan the head honcho. Head, head hog in charge. So... I mean, he's already been the head hog in charge for years. But what this means is he has nobody to answer to. But it's so. They won't be getting no phone calls in the night talking about Dan, what you're doing, because <laughs> Dan's the head honcho. Dan owns the team, and Ron Revere is running the team. And that's that could be a good thing for us. And as far as the name goes, we might be Washington football team for for a while. That might be the new name. Who knows? And I always said, with Dan and that name, he never wanted to switch it. And by it being Washington football team, to me, it, it, it seems like we're still the Redskins. We still got that same Redskin feel as far as, as far as the uniforms go and the color scheme goes. And people are still calling us the Redskins. You got fans right now that still won't let it go. And they're Redskins for life. And I can't hate on that. But Dan Snyder, he's done it again. The evil scientist, majority owner of the football team, and and now he would be the sole owner. The the owners will be. It's gonna basically a formality. The it's all, the deal's already done. So basically, he's taking a loan, some debt, four hundred and something million dollars to buy. To buy the rest of the team, which would be like an eight hundred million dollar deal or some something like that, eight hundred million dollar deal, and I'm happy for Dan. I actually, on contrary to what people believe, I know Dan was getting on my nerves with Bruce, and I was wanting him and Bruce gone. But one thing I can say about Dan, man, he loves this football team, and he and even Joe Gibbs said out of his own mouth that this guy will do anything to get this team back to the way it used to be. So, like I always say, man, Joe Gibbs is probably my favorite, favorite person in sports of all times. And if he and if he vouches for Dan, then I can't hate on Dan either. So, hopefully, we're in the right direction. We're in the right direction. We're more in the right direction than I've ever seen in a while, as far as front office ownership and players. Everything's coming together. But that's just about it, man. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that share. More content is coming. And Dan's not going anywhere. And hell to the football team. <laughs>